After 20,000 downloads of Campermate, the free New Zealand travel app, we thought it was time to bring you a website. Camping.co.nz helps you plan your trip around New Zealand and works exactly like the smartphone app. By clicking on the top left button, you'll see a menu slide out. Here, you can choose from items such as public toilets, road warnings, campgrounds, dump stations, and much more. Once you click on one of these, the icons will appear on the map, which you can also zoom in on. As an example, I'm looking for a dump station in Whanganui, on the west coast of the North Island. Aha! Here's one in Springvale Park, just off London Street. Some campsites in New Zealand only allow camper vans with a toilet on board. These are called self-contained vehicles. You can click on either campgrounds for self-contained vehicles or campground for non-self-contained vehicles to find a campground where you can stay in with the vehicle that you're travelling in. If you're renting a camper van and unsure what type it is, check with your rental company. The green pointer icons means it's free. The blue pointer icon means it's a low cost campsite. The purple icon means it's a fully serviced campground. Normally these are operated as a business where you'll normally pay upwards of $15 per night per person. Road warnings show road delays that last longer than 20 minutes. These are normally incidents such as roadworks, icy roads and sometimes car accidents. Think of these like traffic lights. Red means you'll have to stop, and green means that it's okay to go, or that the road warning has passed. If you find something that isn't on the app or the website, like a public toilet for example, you can add it using the free smartphone app, Campermate. Once this is approved, it'll be added to both the app and the website in real time. To get the app, simply click on the black badges in the left hand corner of the website. Thanks for watching.